Hi, Mr. Knuckles Music Lessons. Today we're going to play a song by the Bare Naked Ladies, a great Canadian band. This is uh, one of their first hits, maybe their, their, the first hit they ever had, called If I Had a Million Dollars. So, one thing about this video is I'm going to talk to you about how to use a capo, one of these little things. So, this is uh, a good capo, but it's not a great capo. It is a spring-loaded capo, so there's a spring in there, and then you squeeze the trigger, the mouth opens up, you put it on your guitar, you let it go, and it clamps down to your guitar, and it works fine. Okay, All right, changes, changes the key. So, for instance, if I was to play a G with the capo on at the second fret, that's the same as playing an A without the capo. So all it does is allow you to play different chords than you would otherwise be able to play. Which doesn't sound like a big deal, but sometimes you'd have to play really complicated chords to play the song, and as soon as you put the capo on, it becomes easy chords that you're used to. So, the other capo, the better capo, the one that I like to use, is one that's not spring-loaded. It's just sort of mechanical. It's got some levers on it and some different little mechanical things. All you do is you put it on, and you push the little lever at the back, and it tightens over a little cam and it grabs and that's it so when you're putting a capo on a guitar if I was to tell you to put it at the second fret you don't put it in the middle of the fret like that you want to have it as close to the fret bar and obviously parallel to the fret bar but as close to the fret bar as you can without covering the fret bar so you should still be able to see the fret bar in there and then you're good okay and everything sounds like it's in tune Okay, this song is going to be played in G. Now, it's not really in the key of G. It's actually in the key of A because, like I say, when I play a G here, it's really an A chord without the capo. But we're going to play it in G, D, C. Those are the basic chords, and every once in a while, there's an E minor. I'll call them out to you. We're starting on G. Don't forget, we use animal. I use animal names instead of the actual chord names because... When they got rhyming with each other, it's hard to discern one from the next. So this is G, D, C, or sorry, goat, dog, cat, E minor. All right, here we go. If I Had a Million Dollars by the Bare Naked Ladies from Canada. Cat, cat again, goat, dog, cat. Goat, dog, cat. Remember, don't worry about your strumming pattern. Just worry about chords. Goat, dog, cat. Goat, dog, cat. Goat, dog, cat. Goat, dog, cat. Gonna just do this pattern over and over again. D is a dog, and you stay on there for a while. Okay, it's gonna change up a little bit. Cat, dog, go. E minor, cat, dog, goat, E minor, cat, dog, goat, E minor, one strum on cat, one strum on dog, and back to the regular, goat, dog, cat, goat, dog, cat, and stop, goat. Cat. Goat. Dog. Cat. Goat.
One strum on dog, back to go. And dog, cat. I had a million dollars. Great Canadian band, Bare Naked Ladies.